So we're going to see the going to see the leaf today and take a test drive on the leaf today, October first, nine a.m. And I'm starting in Seal Beach with one hundred percent. I can go to Santa Monica and back on one charge and still have a lot left. Six thirty-three a.m. and and look at we're already we're already full, all lanes full of traffic. Six thirty a.m. Here's the proof, 85.1% uh, left, and we've gone 18 miles. And then, so that is better than 100 miles range. And here it is in front of Toyota Central. So I can just hear them saying, oh no, here he comes again. Uh, well, not today, but uh, I could come here with the signs and this is the most advanced electric car made so far so what we really want is for Toyota to make more of them and then and this is this is Toyota Central their national headquarters here in Torrance uh, this is just the administrative center but that is what we're going up to Santa Monica today in and yet they don't have any electric car that's as good as this one this one nine years old here's a laugh here's here's the hydrogen facility uh, for Toyota there's uh, shell hydrogen and here is uh, you know stuff parked in the in the way because nobody really wants it and there's a BMW a gasoline car or maybe it's maybe it's hydrogen combustion no it's it's empty and look they've got a they've got a trailer over there but it's all bullshit <laughs> It's all bullshit. They have a they have a porta potty, and this this is going to be supposedly the hydrogen highway, hypeway, hydrogen hydrogen bullshit. Now I wonder if they have a plug around here. That would make it really useful. There is the the pleasant odor of the Chevron Exxon refinery in in Carson. There's beautiful clouds. Wow, look at the sun coming up. And there's ugly clouds. That's the that's the refinery. That's the stink that's coming up from the oil refinery. <laughs> there's the there's the leaf. Here's the Santa Monica stuff. 71.9 and 36.5. It's 108 miles. That's more than 100 miles range, real world range on freeway driving, stop and go driving. So for some reason they want me to move. You know, this, this is the best electric car ever made. 120 miles range. You know, I don't need to fuel this car, which is nine years old and already, you know, at, at the sunset of its life is, is better than any electric car in here. Now this is the, the best electric car ever made the most reliable, the longest lasting, with the best batteries, and the, you know the batteries are all underneath it, so you have uh, full access, you know, to everything. It's uh, you stand clear danger. So it looks like they're going to try to make me move my Rav out of here, you know. But um, I'm, I'm postponing as long as possible because this is really the best EV on the lot. So it really should be on display. This this thing that Toyota has here, you know, they're fine, but they're gas cars. They get all their energy from the gasoline pump. They can't plug in. Supposedly they have one of their 500 uh, plug-in Priuses in the in the hall over there. See, and here's all the RAVs. You know, these are in daily use by building inspectors and city of uh, Santa Monica personnel. One of the city councilmen, Kevin McCune said, you know, they can take them back, but they'll have to get a go over my dead body, is what he said. And he was a big guy at that time. Uh, so this is one of the scammy volts, you know. And look, you know, it's only got, it's only got a little 110 charger. 
And there's another scam evil clogging up the parking spaces for regular EVs. And ironically, you know, these old RAVs are uh, 10 times more sophisticated than that new scummy Volt. And <laughs> no gas, no oil. So where's your plug-in car? Do you have one here today? Right inside. Inside. Yeah. Can I, none of these are plug-in. Uh, no. No. So these are all gas cars, huh? Uh, gas electric. Well, they get all their energy from the gasoline pump. That means they're a gas car. Mm -hmm. they, don't, they don't get anything from the wall. That means they're all gasoline. You should have some plug-in cars. You know, this just looks stupid here with all these Priuses. The 38.5 and 75.3 as it gets lower the uh, the, the miles per one percent actually increases so we've just demonstrated 111 miles range so far down to 37 percent driving 75 miles which included a couple of side trips